Hello everyone, I'm the Demo Man for VGamers. I'm going to be doing game demos, mostly because I don't have that much money. And I thought it was appropriate for my first review to be a sequel to a game I love very, very dearly, Left 4 Dead 2. So, without further ado, here's my thoughts on the game. Now, I'm going to get this out of the way very quickly and say that Left 4 Dead 2 is exactly the same as the first. It's full of zombie slaughter, cool weapons, and overall the game is well built. And there's also a ton of new items and enemies to fight. I'm sure you've heard of the new we melee weapons, and they're great. If it's with a guitar, hunting knife, or police baton, the corpses will be flying and it will be satisfying. However, there's no difference between the new weapons, aside how the zombies react. Each one swings at about the same speed, and there's no real difference damage-wise. There's also new items like Boomer Vile, in which all zombies will rush towards the Boomer Vomit. Another new item is Adrenaline, in which you inject yourself with a needle, then you run, shoot, and reload faster. As for new zombies, there's three new boss zombies. There's the Jockeys, who ride you like a horse, the Spitter, who spits acid that will burn you, and the Charger, who charges at you. Not to mention, all the favorites are back, like the Hunter, Smoker, Boomer, and Tank. The new survivors are interesting, but they can get a little annoying. Rochelle really pisses me off. As a side note, gore fans will love this game. It's nice and gory. Screens will be covered with blood. However, the game suffers a bit for being too much like the original. The melee weapons, as I said, are great, but pushing back zombies is useless now. Melee weapons are one-hit kill, so there's no strategy involved. Also, the boomer bile is useless. Why would I throw the puke when I could just throw a pipe bomb instead? It has the same effect and all the zombies will rush towards it, so it just doesn't really make any sense. Also, the new zombies suck. The jockey takes very little health away and does very little to hinder you. The spitter isn't difficult to kill, and I've never encountered a time where I got hit by the charger. The hardest zombie in the game is actually those police zombies. It took me quite some time to figure out that the only way to kill them is to shoot them in the back. Also, I'm not a fan of the theme. The New Orleans theme does, doesn't really fit with me, and you shouldn't be fighting zombies in broad daylight. The jazz music is alright, but it doesn't feel organic to the game. Overall, this game's okay, but it doesn't have the charm of the original. I haven't tried online yet because the servers are being too bogged down with everyone trying it. It's not unique anymore, and it shows. But for what it's worth, it's a good game. I'd say download it and decide for yourself. I'll be uploading one of these at least once a month, hopefully every two weeks, so I'll be back next time with a new demo.